certainty to the universe at all. Once you really start getting out there, all the physics kind of turn into suggestions. You're pulling my leg again, right? No exaggerations this time. Mm. Unicorn. Not kidding. Wait. The mythical mare with the magic horn thing? Come on. Was King Arthur riding on it too? Okay, it was more of an extreme of file in the big shape of a horse. But my point still stands. Holy shit. You actually found me. I wish I could say this is the first time this has happened with Barrett. But, well, it isn't. Well, this is turning into a regular constellation party, isn't it? I should have bought drinks.
You know, it's actually been kind of nice. Matsura the Grim here is a great host. No sense letting people's last moments be unpleasant. See, that's what I like about you, Matsura. Real renaissance man. I have enjoyed our time together, Barrett. But I can't just let you go with nothing to show for. Is Constellation willing to pay ransom in exchange for this man's freedom? We do have some insurance set aside for this exact problem. Does that mean you'll be paying me, miss? We don't need to be introduced. Here's your money. And we would appreciate it if you could spread the word in the Crimson Fleet that Barrett shouldn't be harassed. It's not working out for any of us. That's a fair point. But I can't control a man's reputation. Do what you can. A suggestion to the right ears can work wonders. Hmm. Very well. Goodbye to you all. I have enjoyed this little exchange. See you around, Metzer. Uh, I mean, well, you know, hopefully not. While we're here, it wouldn't hurt if we checked in at the lodge. It's good to be home. I am at your service, wait, Captain. Got a little held up on Vectera. Barrett, you were worried sick. Well, some of us were. I see what you did there, Walter. And I know you've been secretly crying into your piles of money just waiting for my return. Actually, Walter has been complaining about you more than you I hope you are satisfied stuff. with the quarters available Don't to you. Start, country. Wait, is that? <laughs> and to think the first artifact was taking up dust on the library shelf. Now, look at them all. You feel it a bit can't you? Ever since I found the second one, had the visions. Being around them is just comforting. So hey, I'm still not a hundred percent, plus I feel guilty dragging you into all of this. Why don't I stick around, help you get adjusted to the weird corners of the universe? Marvelous. at your service, Captain.
We got a rook on deck. Good to see Constellation getting some fresh blood. Aha! You got your nickname from Vlad. You're official now. Wish I could have been down at the lodge to see the artifacts come together. But I got a little lost peeking through the eye. <laughs> Probably would have just gotten annoyed at being bothered. I'll catch a smile at our next big revelation. You know there's more to come. Now, this station, the Eye, rigged up for deep space scans. Barrett and Sarah teased out the signs of where our artifacts could be hiding after we caught our second one. But the data takes a slow ride along the Sea of Light. Years or decades between us and the fringes of space without a grav drive. You won't be the only constellation out there. Andresia and Matteo are both following up on scans themselves. Matteo went out recently, but Andresia... It's been a while. Hate to pull a worried old man act on you, but... I'm an old man, and... I'm worried. It's okay to be worried about her, Vlad. She's been out there for a while. She should be at one of the two sites I've marked on your star map. Can take care of herself, but we all need backup sometimes. Anyway, hopefully you'll be catching Fortune's smile, and we'll have some more artifacts to take a closer look at. Happy hunting. Show the words another time, then.
I should have packed a sweater. Or ten. some planets, it takes a millennia for some cave formations to grow. Don't On come others, any it can closer. take days. Identify yourself. You are from Constellation. Vladimir said someone might be coming. Andresia, good to see you. Looking a little more murdery than usual, but let's just say they had it coming. You are the newest member, yes? Do they often send you to check up on other, more senior members? Dutifully following orders. I should not be frustrated with you. It is good that you have their trust. We waste time. We should complete our mission and then we can talk. Yeah, 
We're good. I was wondering if this was going to happen. Where'd they go?
you did not respond when I called to you after you pulled out the artifact. Does that mean Barrett's theory and experience were correct? The artifact grants the first person who touches it a vision? The fact that it has happened to both you and Barrett is already more than we had before. I think it is important that we discuss what you saw back there. That man. What I had done. It was, yes. I appreciate that you see it that way. A very practical outlook, not one I find is shared amongst members of Constellation. May I ask what your background is? Argos. I have heard of this company. Small, reckless. Interesting. I do not have experience with this profession, but I have my own experiences with... <sighs> risk. We both seem to be unusual additions to Constellation. Please, I would ask that you not mention to Vladimir the... the circumstances in which you found me. This is not the first time that Varun zealots have attempted to corner me. If it is known that this has happened again, well, it has been a while since I was given an assignment on my own. I would not want it to be even longer in the future. Do you understand? Mom, this means we are in agreement. Thank you. That is good to know. I will finish here and return to New Atlantis when I can. You should go now, as they will be expecting us.
Atlantis is the shining beacon of humanity these days, so they say. I'd argue that the place is a delightful relic tangled up with hope, grit, and science. You aren't satisfied with the quarters available to you. Look at you two. I'm jealous. I tried following up on some leads myself, but came back empty-handed. They could be anywhere, can't they? Embedded in a rock, or in the hands of an unsuspecting novelty goods trader? I wasn't aware we were competing, but game on. Oh no, don't you two start. We're supposed to be working together, not competing. What's wrong with a little rivalry here and there? I think it pushes us to be at our best or causes nothing but arguments. Arguments which then breed distrust. Noel is right, Matteo. Well, I suppose there was that one time, and then the other. Mm, what do you think? A little competition can't be that bad, can it? I'm the villain in this story. I can't believe I'm the one pushing us to be tougher for once. You're spending too much time with Walter Mateo. He's turning our adorable teddy bear into a grizzly. Competition is a spice, not a main course. I want it to be there, to be present, but I can't survive on it. You know what? I just realized I completely overtook this whole conversation. This should be about you and Andresia celebrating a win for the group. I do not mind being asked to join in a debate. It was good to hear everyone's sides, but I do agree that we accomplished something together. Thank you for your help. I have no objections. Let us see what else we can find out there. Noel, pulling some interesting data from those new artifacts. Tell the Rook to meet me back on board the station. Oh, I... I'm all ears. Thank you, but it was not necessary. We succeeded. I hope you are satisfied with the quarters available to you. Now that those artifacts aren't just blips of hope in the Blackest Sea, I found an interesting pattern. The grav anomaly generated by one of those artifacts? It matches one on another planet. A bigger one. Alright, let me transfer over the data. But, I need you wearing caution boots for this one. No telling what this thing is or why it's so large. Going to send you the mark close as I can but I'm having trouble pinpointing the source. You'll need to explore the area on foot. Put your scanner to work. Don't know what you'll find. Keep your eyes open. And from there, maybe you catch a smile and uncover the source of it all.
are worlds to conquer. your scanner review.
not spend as much time here as some of the others, but I appreciate that I was still given my own room. Crix's bones. Look at you. If you don't mind, I'm gonna start doing some scans. Like, right now. We were right about the anomaly, weren't we? Tip our ears on the tail. An entire building generating a signature just like the artifact. Um, Vladimir, look at these readings. Cardiovascular and neurological levels aren't in the normal range. I think we're going to need a little demonstration. Mind putting the paces to it? Everyone saw that, right? Like a literal gift from the heavens. And also the most practical consequence of our little venture thus far. Got no old shipwise for this one. Going to just call weird, weird. So we have artifacts, a temple, and this power. All connected. But we do not understand the connections. We need additional information. Can we find more of them? Already picked one up from the scans. Matches another one of the artifacts we found. In theory, there might be one temple for each. But sifting through all the signs to identify a match is tricky. Impossible if we don't have the right artifact to compare. And even then, it takes time. Don't think it's just Fortune's laugh that this temple responded to you. The artifacts, the visions, this power you've gotten, all seems to be the same song somehow. Plenty to think about. Anyway, catch a smile out there. I'll work on finding planet anomalies that match the other artifacts we have. Fortunate that Walter has used his considerable funds to maintain the lodge, are we not? Sarah is the best it's possible. And you must be the latest poor fool to get dragged into our dysfunctional little family. Nonsense and dedicated. Just a friendly jab. Small group like this, you'll learn more about everyone than you ever wanted to. Kind of all that family is, in a way. Like more than you'd ever want to know. Hello, kids are around, people. Koriko, by the way. Hi, hi. Nice to meet anyone brave enough to fly the frontier. Oh, you definitely take after your father. Hey, don't spook our new friend. Frontier's a fine ship. Honest. Now, let's talk business. Sarah tell you about the expedition? Sure enough, that's where we're heading. The three of us are heading to Aquila, for a settled planet of the Freestar Collective and, not coincidentally, the home of their capital, Aquila City. We'll land in the city's spaceports, but the frontier is our goal. It's a rough country, spawned a lot of stories. And I got a lead on a tale that um, makes me think one thing. Artifact. Okay, we'll meet you on board your ship. Talk more when we get there. Once we land on Aquila, it's gonna be you and me. So if you wanna do any freewheeling before then, Cora and I will just be riding passenger. <laughs> <laughs> 
Feel free to help yourself at the bar. I don't drink, but I feel like if I did, now would be a 